Hi, this is Mike Koenigs. Welcome to Digital Cafe. This is the brand new Flip Minnow HD. It's an awesome video camera that costs about $200 and I'd like to review it for you today and tell you all about it and tell you why I love it so much. So we'll talk a little bit about the system requirements, the features and the differences between this flip and the other flips, what the limitations of it are. I'm going to give you a brief demonstration and also show you the flip software. So a couple things about the features. First of all, it records in 720p, which is a high definition form that YouTube now supports, and it looks actually phenomenal. I can't believe the light sensitivity of this little thing. And like the other one, you've got a little built-in USB port. We can uh, show this on the uh, camera over here. This little thing plugs right into your computer and uh, allows you to record without any tape at all. So the other thing it has is four gigabytes of storage, which lets you record 60 minutes of video. It comes with built-in software for PCs and Macs. So you can use it with both, and it works wonderfully. Of course, it's easy to use and affordable, and it has built-in rechargeable batteries. So as long as it's plugged into your computer, it's charging up. You can publish everywhere with it, and of course, it's a perfect companion to Traffic Geyser, which is one of the things I love about it. Now, in terms of the overall differences and limitations, it is significantly better quality than the other devices. I found it to be faster in operation. Now, the biggest limitation that I see with it is the lack of a microphone jack. You can't plug in an external microphone, which is a bummer. And the other thing is it can't be used as a webcam. It is a record-only gadget. So if you want to use it and put it on top of your PC and have some way of hooking it up, you, there's a no-can-do there. Now, in terms of the demonstration, what I'm going to do for you right now is just show you exactly how it works. So if we move over here, let me show you some of the basic functionality. Now, on this side, we have the power button. So if I just click the power button, it's going to give us a nice little beep and a welcome screen. And you can see the time left. I've shot about five minutes of video. Now, if I move over here to this camera, what I'm going to do is click the red button. You'll see that right here. And as soon as I click, we're going to see a red light appear. Now you'll see that right inside the camera. And I'm going to record myself for just a moment. I'm going to talk, 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 talk. And I'm talking to you about how great the Flip HD is. Now when I'm done recording, I just simply click the red button again. And the little red light will turn off as soon as I do that. Okay, little red button. Okay, there we go. And once that is done, I can go back over here and click the play button. All right, so let me just show you what happens when I do that. If I um, go over here, I can flip through the various videos, press the play button. I'm doing this mirror image. Okay, there it is. And you can fast forward, you can rewind, you can delete your videos. You can see how I have the little button there for that. But the functional, functionality of this thing is really, really simple and easy. I just, again, I, I love the thing. And what's great about it are, I think you can actually produce professional quality products with this thing if you're a first time um, product creator, for example. Or one of the things that I'd recommend you do is if you have some sort of an offline or a service business, every single one of your employees should have some kind of a flip and after a successful transaction, ask for a testimonial broadcast that. It's a great way to develop um, you know, proof that your product or service works. So from a marketing perspective, that's what I love about it. So as far as the rest of this, what I'm going to do next is I'm going to take the camera and I have my little cable here, which is stretching to my USB port on my computer because it's off camera. And if I want to access the software, I simply plug it in. Okay. And in a matter of a couple seconds, as soon as I get this little devil inside here, oh, there we go, I was plugging it in backwards. Once I've got it plugged in here, it'll just show up as a USB hard disk to my computer. And the Flip software will automatically appear. Okay, here's the review of the new Flip Minnow HD, one of my new favorite gadgets. I'm going to just show you what the internal software is like. So here you can see the software is shown up. If I click on camcorder, it shows all the current videos that are in here, and I can 
zoom through them if I want to. Here's some of our little examples. And just so you see this, whether you're on a PC or a Mac, it actually just shows up like a little hard disk. You can open up the standard folder. It's just like a memory stick on your computer. And I could easily double click here and open up one of my videos in full high definition format. So here's the latest um, little video, which again, it just appears in a, a normal fashion. Pretty cool. And from within the FlipShare software, there's a tool in here that lets you save to your computer if you want to. You can make uh, send it out as email. You can share as a greeting card. You can upload it online. You can create a movie in different formats. This one lets you actually create a still image from one of the um, videos. And this thing actually lets you make a DVD. So you can easily just create a folder, drag all the files you want over here, and um, it's darn simple. So let's say, for example, you had one of your little videos, like my little walkthrough video that I have here. Again, you can look at it very, very quickly. Preview it. All right. Pretty neat. Zoom around. And if I wanted to turn that into, let's say, a greeting card, click on here. They've got different categories. So maybe I'd want to say, uh, let's see what their others are. Okay. Get well, you're invited. So you can make a little invitation. Um maybe something for a little business purpose. So if I just check that little box, click on next. Okay, so you can pick the videos. You can add multiple videos in there if you want, change the order. Here you can decide you know, who you want to mail to and uh, put in a message and this thing will get sent out as soon as it gets done processing the video. Same is true with the online feature. This will let you upload directly to YouTube or MySpace or AOL video. Or it'd be super easy just to log into your Traffic Geyser account, select the video on your disk, upload it, broadcast it to over 30 different video sites. So, um, of course, you can manage the videos and throw them away if you want to. You can trash them, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. It is super easy to use. I highly recommend it. And here's the other thing that I think is really cool. The PC version of the software is actually a little more advanced than the Mac version. So uh, if you're a PC user, I think you're going to benefit from that. They've got editing functionality built in, a few, ex few extra features. But overall, fabulous product. And I'll show you another demonstration in just a moment. See ya. Well, that about wraps it up for this demonstration. What I invite you to do is post your comments and your questions to the blog. I'll answer as many questions as I have. And if you have some other ideas, some other products that you'd like reviewed, make sure you post those as well. And we will be announcing the winner of the Flip Minnow HD within the next couple of weeks. And uh, we'll post it both here on the blog and we'll notify the winner. I'm looking forward to seeing you in one of the upcoming reviews that I do. Bye now. Hey everyone, this is Mike Koenigs. You are looking at me through the Flip Minnow HD. Why don't you come around and you can see the quality of this thing, how good it is. My trusty cameraman, Mr. Zach, is busy trying to keep that critter steady. He's got the shakes today. But you'll see how nice this thing looks. And I'm going to let you download the original file that came right off the flip camera so you can see the phenomenal quality. It uses MPEG-4. H2.64, which is the fancy new compression system that YouTube loves, loves to take. So here we are, we're in the fancy digital cafe. You can see the quality. I give this thing a five star rating. In terms of overall value, the only thing that I would say makes it a lesser value than say a higher end camera is the fact that it doesn't have a microphone port. I would say that in terms of the light sensitivity, it's great. I can't believe how good this thing looks, even in poor lighting situations. And it's good enough that you could actually use it to make a little cheap information product. I've got a good friend who's made a $1,500 information product using nothing more than a little flip camera. So, it's one of my favorite new gadgets. I bring mine with me everywhere I go. I'll see you later. Whenever you think of it, post it on the blog. Bye now.